Good morning, good afternoon. I'm Father Tom Baker. I'm here at the Cathedral in Topeka for an all day meeting with the Council of Trustees. But we still have noonday prayer for St. Aidan's here and we welcome you all. Thank you so much for being here. Our noonday prayer today is a little different. It is on page 103 of the Book of Common Prayer, but there'll be some different prayers that we're using today. So let us begin. O Lord, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Today's Psalm is Psalm 9, verses 7 through 14. The law of the Lord is perfect and receives, revives the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure and gives wisdom to the innocent. The statutes of the Lord are just and rejoice in the heart. The commandment of the Lord is clear and gives light to the eyes. The fear of the Lord is clean and endures forever. The judgments of the Lord are true and righteous. More than desired than gold, more than fine gold, sweeter than honey, honey in the comb. By them is also your servant enlightened, but in keeping them there is great reward. Who can follow, who can tell how often he offends, cleanse me from my secret faults, O God. Above all, keep your servant away from presumptuous sins. Let them not get dominion over me. Then I shall be whole and sound and innocent of great offense. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of our hearts be acceptable to you, O Lord, my strength and my redeemer. Glory be to the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Offer now, please, any inter intercessions you may have allowed, or you may put them in the comment section. Pray for all the priests of our diocese and for our bishop. We pray for those who are sick, those who care for them. Pray for the homeless, the lost, the least. And for all our prayers, we lift them up to the Lord. And let us pray together the words our Savior gave us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. And also we have some prayer requests that have just come up. We especially remember the people of Afghan, Afghanistan and for the people of Haiti. That the Lord's light and peace will be with all of them. We hope to see you Sunday at St. Aidan's for 10 o'clock service. And on the 29th of September, we'll be celebrating our St. Aidan's feast day. So please come by and celebrate with us. I hope you have a great rest of the week. Have a good day. Take care.